Hey guys, it's Swordfish. I'm back, finally, with another video. Um, this one is not my proudest work. It's a little little bit of a mess, but I mean, that's fine. They're really just trying to get back into the swing of things. Um, but for this one, I wanted to try something a little different. I wanted to see, uh, you know, a different kind of lighting. I wanted to build in the night mode. See, uh, in Townscaper, when you set the, the sun to going down, it turns all the colors grayscale, and uh, the lights in the buildings light up. It's just something different that I wanted to try uh, building with, because there's something uh, very uh, unique that you can do when you're in this night mode, because all the colors are similar, so it's much easier to use multiple colors in a build. Oh, uh, without it getting messy. And I wanted to just kind of showcase that in this build. Again, it's not my favorite. Uh, I wanted... It's a castle, and I wanted to make it like one of the like Halloween castles, where it's just like, everything's really uneven and stuff. And I mean, I did an okay job, but part of it, it's a little too messy, in my opinion. But, um... Uh, I think it's turned out okay. But yeah, I'm back. I don't know how long my motivation comes and goes. I was just, I got really busy and then I forgot about the channel, but, you know. Let me, let me turn this down a little, it seems too loud. But yeah. And so, again, just doing the, the standard kind of outline that you have to do in the beginning of any build. That part was kind of, wasn't too happy about it. It wasn't looking how I wanted it to, but with Townscaper, it's kind of hard to make things perfect, and I, that's kind of the point, which is something I like about it, the game. Alright, so now it's time to fill in the ground. I'm not going too high up for this one, just up by two, so. And you can see there, I'm kind of playing around with uh, blending multiple colors. Anyway, yeah, while we fill this in, let's talk about the future of the channel. There's some new stuff I want to try out. Um, there's Townscaper VR. I'd love to go in and see what that's like. Because uh, I do have a VR headset, so maybe we'll look, about, look into that. Um, I've seen some, like, Townscaper modding where you can, like, change the textures. I want to try that. There's, like, a winter one that I saw. Um, I would like to build with that. So, we might do that. I would also like to, to finally branch out into a different game. I haven't decided which. I'm thinking Terraria. That's a game that I'm actually pretty good at building in. So, you know, maybe, maybe expect to see something in that game soon. Alright, so we're almost done filling this in. Yeah, I know every every video I feel like I say, oh, I'm going to do this and this, and I never do. But again, my motivation is just like there sometimes, and sometimes it's not. But alright, so now we're going to start building the actual uh, base of the castle, just kind of outlining what it's going to look like. This one, I, I tried to make it uh, just kind of rectangular, but going in a diagonal, which is a little hard. So some of the walls are... A little jagged but you can see you can kind of see uh it is kind of rectangular in a way and that's the the basic castle outline and then we're gonna build up the front here i'm trying to figure out you know how tall do i want this to be i don't want this to look and then add that part to the front because i don't want when things look too flat they just they just look bad so i'm looking at it probably looking at like a reference or something here i I forget. It's been like a month since I recorded this, so. Or well, maybe my mom called me for something. I don't, I don't know. <laughs> Alright. Now it's time to uh, finish this kind of front of the castle. As you can see, what I said there is I wanted it to be asymmetrical, right? You know, some stuff is some way, some stuff is the other. And that's a pretty happy with the, um, 
with the front here already, you know, this is looking how I wanted it to look uh, when I think of a Halloween kind of castle. Very tall, very imperfect. Changed the back a little and didn't want it to go all the far, all the way out. And then just filling in the back. This part I struggled with a while uh, just because, I don't know, it just it was never looking the way I wanted it to. And it just felt weird to just have the castle be, like, thin. So I wanted to back, but it just wasn't looking how I wanted it to. Uh, but you can see here, we're adding the sides, these, like, side parts here. And I'm adding a tower on this side. I'm going to end up adding a tower on the other side as well to give, you know, some kind of symmetry in the back there. Because it looked weird to just have one tower going in place and the rest... There we go. And then that part looked, it looked too flat. It looked weird. So I added a little a little back part here. And then I extended it outwards. In the back there. And connected it to the tower. And connected it which to what will be another tower. Once I get to that part. I'm looking around and I'm like. Oh, it looks weird just having that one tower. So I'm going to build up a second one. Unfortunately, the grid there is a bit awkward. As you can see there, it doesn't let me do a four off of it, but I, I can get in three, and it looks a little better. You can see from the front, it just looks a little messy from the front, but everywhere else, I'm I'm not too unhappy with it. It's just that front, when you look at it from the front, that, you know, it just seems a little off. And then um, here you can really see, this is what you can do with the, with the night mode. It's this, you know mixing in different colors to make it look like some parts of the castle or of the bricks are a little more worn than others you know you can really just mix in all the colors because they're all just different shades of gray and you can add more texture which is just something you can't do with uh with the normal day mode and i really really went crazy with this idea and it looks pretty good. I, I, I'm happy with it. I don't think this part is the messy part. Because I think it's like messy on purpose. Like, you know, in a good way. Although, uh, that did mess up some stuff there. You can see, it looks pretty cool. With the whole... Uh... Oh, yeah, there. I added a lighthouse kind of portion because since... Uh, you can mix and match colors. I could make a lighthouse there, and you know, it's just different, like a little watchtower part of the castle. Again, going back to that asymmetrical part, you know, it's just something different, something unique that you uh, you can't really do with other other builds in the in the day mode. Which is really all this was about is really just showcasing the stuff you can do with the night mode, how you can make builds a little different. And just, you know, unfortunately in Townscaper, I find a lot of builds end up looking pretty similar. Just because of the nature of Townscaper and how limited it is. But this is just a way you can make something new. Alright, just detailing this. The towers here, adding some arches. Trying to add some more depth to the build. But it's... Pretty much done with the castle part of it. See, I'm looking around, seeing if there's anything I want to change, but I'm, I'm pretty happy with it. I think it looks pretty good. So now it's on to adding the garden. I really like gardens in Townscaper. They look so cool. So they're easily one of my favorite parts of Townscaper are these gardens because they just they look so sick. And so nice. And they add some life into the, you know, pretty empty world of Talonscaper. You know, there's just birds. That's all there is. It adds more life, which I like. Oh, there's like butterflies in it, too. Adding some little builds in front to just break up the flat uh, bottom. And, you know, there it is. Spooky Castle. That's what I called it. Because originally I was going to do this 
for Halloween. Um, but then Halloween went by. And then November went by. And then most of December went by. And now we're here, and it's just a castle at night. I don't know. I'm gonna, I don't know. I don't know what I'll call it. But anyway, thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe, and I'll be back sometime eventually.